Ole Gunnar Solskjaer remains in charge as Manchester United board disagree over Antonio Conte and Mauricio Pochettino. Ole Gunnar Solskjaer has been given a stay of execution at Old Trafford as Manchester United's board are split in opinion over who should succeed the Norwegian. United's board held crisis talks on Monday to discuss Solskjaer's future, but the Norwegian remains in charge despite an embarrassing 5-0 defeat to arch-rivals Liverpool. The club are now minded to part with Solskjaer, despite handing him a new three-year deal last summer and unanimously backing him as recently as last week, following the 4-2 defeat to Leicester City. However, ESPN claims there's a dispute among the United Herici over who to turn to, with the board split between backers of Antonio Conte and Mauricio Pochettino. Conte is a free agent after leaving Inter Milan and the Italian has made it known that he would be willing to break his own rule of taking over a team midway through the season. The former Chelsea boss is widely considered one of the finest managers in the world, but his brand of football is pragmatic, with some on the United board feeling it runs against a cultural reboot that Solskjaer has undertaken in the last three years. There is also a fear that Conte would only represent a short-term solution to the club's problems and that he will not think about the long-term success of the club. On the other side of the board are backers of Paris Saint-Germain boss Pochettino. The Argentine was a leading candidate to replace Jose Mourinho in December 2018, and the then Tottenham boss was keen on taking charge at Old Trafford. However, Solskjaer's early success saw United cool their interest in Pochettino, and he joined PSG last year after being sacked by Spurs in November 2019. Man United include Brendan Rodgers on four-man shortlist to replace Ole Gunnar Solskjaer, Antonio Conte makes decision over Man United job after initial talks with club Cristiano Ronaldo, becoming irritated with Man United teammate after Liverpool defeat Pochettino remains open to managing at the Theatre of Dreams one day, but he's had a difficult stint in the French capital and he would represent a more expensive option for United, who would have to compensate the League One giants to hire him. With a split at board level, Solskjaer will be given some extra time to turn his reign around, but there's an acceptance that he's likely to be sacked by the international break. United face Spurs, Atalanta and Manchester City in their next three matches, and the Norwegian would need positive results to cling onto his job. More, Andy Murray asked if he regrets playing in the same era as Roger Federer, Novak Djokovic and Rafael Nadal. For more stories like this check our sport.